Hey you guys, this is Dee Spoiled as Tabor coming to you with another video, an unboxing. And also I did get a new camera, so we're going to see how the quality works out in this camera. I was recording previously on my iPhone and then downloading into iMovies to edit and everything. But the new camera that I did get today, um, a few weeks ago was the Sony A5000. So this is my first time, you know, recording with it and we're going to see how the quality turns out. But from here, we're going to also talk about my unboxing and why I chose to do this unboxing. I previously, this is a pre-owned item with new with tags, never used. But I previously decided to go this route because I have bought all my handbags and everything is high-end luxury Chanel Louis Vuitton. So I was carrying them to work and I decided I didn't want to carry them to work anymore. So I bought a Michael Kors to substitute just to carry as a work bag. And then my high-end luxuries Chanel Louis Vuitton carry those, you know, weekends, special occasions and things like that. So I already gave the video away of what the unboxing was. So further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. So here is the box that it came in. Like I did say, I did buy this from eBay from a reliable user. Item did come with tags, receipt, um, never used. She said she decided to sell the item because the item was too big for her more than what she thought from looking at it online when she purchased it. Me, I do like big bags, you know. I'm trying to transition from big bags to like crossbodies, medium sized bags, you know. Nothing too small because I can't do a small body bag. So, let's get into it. Okay. Here is the packaging so far, what she had inside. And let's just set the box down. Okay, here is the dust bag. I don't know if you can see it real good and clear. And the item that I chose to get as a work bag was the Michael Kors North and South Hamilton bag. Here's the front with the lock on it, the Michael Kors lock. The key is on the inside of it. Don't think you can actually see it in there a little bit. Like I said, it did come with this receipt. I got a good deal on this bag, so that was another reason why I decided to go ahead and purchase it. The bag originally cost $358. She bought it from Macy's. And here is the tag. I don't know if you can see it, if it's blurry or not. I'm still trying to get used to the camera. Anyway, here is the back of the bag. I'm loving the color. That was another reason I decided to go ahead and do it. I don't normally do Michael Courses. You know, like I said, I stick to the Louis Vuitton and the Chanel. Um, I just, with the job that I work at, I just don't want to carry my Chanel and my Louis Vuittons to work. So I decided to go for this again. The packaging inside. It has two pockets on the front side. If you can see right here, it's two packages. Two pockets, I'm sorry. And then on the inside, it also has like a D-ring where you can hook your keys to or something, a little clip at the end. On the back side of the purse, it has two pockets. Let's see. It has two pockets right there, and then it also has a long a zipper pocket. The bag is pretty deep, so you can also carry it on your arm if you choose to, or 
you can carry it on the strap on your shoulder if you choose to but more than likely I'll probably just leave the chain at the bottom like that just carry it on my arm or just carry it like this you know no big deal like I said it's only using it for a work bag but I really truly do like the color of it that's what made me get the item and also I seen this bag on one of my um, followers that I follow on Instagram I believe her name is bag so blessed or something like that I would have to look it up it and tell you the name but she really had the same bag and I just love the way she had displayed it on Instagram so I decided to go with this one because of the color like I said so I just wanted to come on here and like I said do a little short unboxing since I've never done well I can't say I've never done unboxing because I have but uh, Michael Kors unboxing um what else I plan on doing more videos, at least trying to do maybe one once a week and stay on YouTube a little bit more often than I have. I still have yet to do a blog video, so I'm still working on that. Um, but any two, anyway, I just wanted to come on here and say hi, you guys. Hope you like this video. If so, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you in a few. Thank you.